Even with some workers' bodies and workers' representatives blaming the judiciary for arresting its driver for complaining about his welfare, the judiciary is not about to give up on the matter. Stanley Sambida was arrested on Monday after recording about poor pay and threatening he could harm the people he drives. The judiciary's permanent secretary, Pius Bijirimana, says Chisambira's claims are all lies. This Chisambira told lies to you, the public, that he gets 200,000 shillings only. I have got evidence here that he gets more than that. Actually, if you add what he gets in a month, it's more than 1.3 million shillings. The driver, who has been in police custody since Monday, was released this afternoon. We have uh, forwarded the file to the resident state attorney for perusal and advice. However, uh, there are some bits of evidence we are still looking for, for a case to stand in case there uh, is to be any. He rubbished the narrative by the judiciary. According to Chisambira, he receives the allowances on a quarterly basis and insists that the matter of salaries must be addressed. Bijirimana emphasized that such lies cannot go unpunished. The public service is not a jungle where you go and do whatever you want to do and go away with it. No. He has to answer why. In fact, I've written to him to show causes to why I can't have him disciplined. According to Bijirimana, through the Public Service Code of Conduct, he has asked Chisambira to explain himself and blamed him for not using the available internal mechanisms to express his dissatisfaction. Why would you go to the social media? Which means there is some other forces behind him. And for that matter, we are going to deal with it. We are going to deal with it administratively. Bijirimana spoke to journalists at an event where judiciary outlined the fulfillment of its manifesto commitments with an emphasis on fighting corruption. Ali Mivole, NTV.